Tonight, the main choices for payment for decades has been cash or card. But now there's a third option at some businesses, cryptocurrencies. A coffee shop in downtown Montgomery is the latest to add the option, and that's why they held a panel with crypto experts and representatives from both parties. Our Simon Schusler has the story. Prevail Coffee on Montgomery's historic Dexter Avenue is now accepting cryptocurrency. Founder Wade Preston says it's not only more convenient for some customers, it also benefits his overseas suppliers. People can pay with cryptocurrency. They pay with a stable coin, so it's just like a U.S. dollar. And when they do, uh, a portion of this every, every sale goes to one of our coffee growing partners in Costa Rica. The shop hosted a panel discussion featuring Preston along with an official from cryptocurrency platform Coinbase as well as state representatives from both political parties. And the reason I think that there's so much bipartisan support on this is that it economically can benefit so many people. Uh, if they are able to access this other kind of currency, if they're able to access this other kind of technology, uh, it can mean more money in their pockets. Republican State House member Mike Shaw agrees. He first got into crypto over a decade ago and says he's been able to see the journey of the new technology over that time. It'll be interesting one day if AI and crypto merge, you know, a little bit. You, you'll see something like that at some point in the next few years. Shaw says since the technology is relatively new, many state lawmakers are still educating themselves on the issue. A lot of it's just uh, understanding it first. You know, no legislator wants to pass something that they're, they don't understand or they're scared of or might. But no, no legislator wants to cause problems on purpose, you know. According to officials, around 20% of Alabamians own cryptocurrency. A new way to pay. The question is, will it stay? Simon Schusler, WSFA 12 News. Also at the events, Republican U.S. House candidate for Alabama's 2nd District, Caroline Dobson. She spoke on cryptocurrency and claimed she has owned it for six years.